when you activate this chi inside you, this chi has the intelligence to help you to fix any damage system. Everything is energy. A tree, the food you eat, and water, and including cancer. Cancer forms because of energy blockages in the body, and the energy blockages in the body is also a form of energy. Energy cannot be created, cannot be destroyed, but energy can be transformed. Through opening your heart, this is the technique. This is the most powerful technique. Open your heart. Allow your unconditional love to come out, to serve you, to direct you. And then another, the tools will come to you to help you to transform that tumors into something beautiful and healing. So, and in my classes, I tell people, you know, like loving your cancer, actually you're sending the positive energy automatically transform that energy into something beautiful and healing. First of all, this word, Qi means an, uh, life force with intelligence. Gong means work or method, or the way to make things work. So put this qigong together is the method of working with the life force with intelligence to help you to balance your body, to help you to heal, to help you with any, any purposes you want to achieve in your life. So in the Spring Forest Qigong, boy, so God, I tell you, um, I developed Spring Forest Qigong because of my personal experience and my personal was no commitment to uh, share what I know with the world. Um, after I, I healed my severe arthritis, bones broke all over my body because of the pains and sufferings from cultural revolution, from uh, a severe uh, suicidal depression, and so basic uh, emotions and pains, you know, eventually manifesting in my spine and my joints and causing that problems. And then I tried everything, you, you just name it, everything, you know, Chinese medicine, um, Western medicine, you know, so my symptoms just got worse. Until one day, I was introduced to a Qigong workshop that was in, when I was in China. There's a lot of people on the dirt ground in a soccer field. I was meditating there with a uh, with a master together with thousands of people, you know. So after that seven hours um, meditation, and um, the pain in my knees completely, I mean, eighty percent gone, and then the swelling in my knees completely went away. And then the biggest surprise to me was my suicidal depression went away too. It started from that moment on. Every day I was living a happy and joyful and life. You've got energy blockages in the body. For instance, if you have a good energy blockage in the C7, when you bend over, you touch your neck, there's a hump over there, that is the C7. When there's a blockage over here, you know, this blockage could cause how many different kinds of symptoms or illnesses in your body. High blood pressure, heart attack, diabetes, asthma, any types of breathing problems, migraine habits, you just name it. So if you throw away, you can help yourself to open up this energy blockage, all these symptoms can go away. Qigong has four elements. These four elements can help you to open up these energy blockages. The first one is the movement. The way you move your hands, the way you, you hold the posture of your body, when we do the muscle arts, you just hold the hands like this. For healing, you will find out all the movements, no matter in yoga practice or in Tai Chi or in Qigong, we all focus a lot in the hands, the movement in the hands, and of course the legs too. Because this is the formation of the body. In the body, we have 12 major energy channels. These 12 major energy channels, they either, that's called, with acupuncture, we call it meridians. They either start or end from the hand or the feet. So among these 12 energy channels, two energy channels that are mainly in charge of detoxification. These two energy channels, they are bladder energy channels and stomach energy channels. The stomach energy channels start from the, from the eyes over here. It goes 
down a little bit and up the temples and then down to the neck, like to the breast and liver and the peril, you know, down to the second top. The bladder in this channel starts from the corner of the eyes, it goes up to the top of the head and then back up and then down along the spine, outside the spine, and dump the garbage out through the little hole. So that's why you need to put your feet on the ground. No matter how much you do, you need to get on your feet and do your exercise and walk. If you don't, you cannot help the body to process the information, detoxifying the body. Two energy channels may be in charge of energy gaining in the body. That is the kidney energy channels and then the liver energy channels. They all start from the feet and up to the chest. And liver energy channel, and then the liver organ has a special energy channel connects directly to the brain. Any problems, almost any problems, no matter you call it as migraine headaches to a cancer, they all have something to do with the liver. The liver, 70% of the toxin inside the body goes out through the liver system. 30% goes out through the breathing system, the lungs. Help yourself to detoxify this toxin, this energy blockages in your body. You can live a very happy and healthy life. This is slow movement. Repeated slow movement can help the body to generate energy. And then gradually, when the energy flows, it helps to open up energy blockages in the energy channels. Then the body heals. So, you know, th at this moment, I want you to stand up. Let's uh, do a couple of Qigong movements, uh, one Qigong movement, right? So I want you to bounce your body. <clears throat> Drop your shoulders. Let go with your stomach. Let go with your spine, but keep your spine relaxed and straight and focus on your knees and then bounce like this. This movement looks like, right? It's very simple. Everybody can do it. You don't have to become an expert to do this movement. And you can do it any place you want. But by bouncing like this, like a 10 minutes, you know what has, what's going to happen? It helps you. Now continue to bounce. It helps you to balance your body's magnetic field in alignment with the magnetic field of the clan, of the ground, the earth, and the nature. That's number one. From the bigger picture, that's the energy you get. Number two, by bouncing like that, it helps you. You see, when you bounce, your, your spine is just like this, right? It helps you gently pumping the energy from, from your spine up to the top of the head and make the circulation naturally. This will be very good for your limb system, for your nerve system, for your immune system, for your digestive system. And put the energy system which have been out of all in your internal organs back to the right place. This is it. Now, have your hands up, continue to bounce. Let go with your wrist, like what I do. When you bounce like this, you help to create force from the hands going down to the body to cleanse the channels open. Any energy blockages with the lungs, with the reproductive organs especially, this is a very good movement. And I have many students, some advanced students here, and you can talk to her up, talk, talk to them up to our session. All right now, put put your hands down. All right, now we start doing one movement. It's called moving of yin and yang. Everybody, please hold your hands like this. Fingers slightly open, like you're holding a ball, right? With that kind of a posture. All right. And slowly, now you start to move in your hands. Your right hand moves out and down, left hand moves in and up. Move slowly, gently up to the forehead, 
down to the bladder level, and then rotate your hands in a circular way. Do it slowly, right? In a circular way. The left hand moves up, and the right hand moves out and down. Then left hand moves out and down, and right hand moves in and out. And you have your hands move close to your body like that. And you repeat this movement with the knees bent a little. That's even better. Slowly, just move your hands like that. By moving your hands like this, it can help to open up channels in the heart. Especially, this movement has great effect for healing cancer. Why so? Well, if this movement can help to open up the blockages for healing with the cancer, how about other energy blockages? Of course, they're much simpler than. The energy blockages of cancer in most people's mind, and you you move this movement for five minutes, ten minutes. If you have time, do it for half an hour. Just do this one movement. That will help you to open up channels. All right, now slowly put your hands down, facing your. Belly button for men, left hand inside. For women, right hand inside. And you take a deep breath. All right. So wrap your hands and massage your face.